<laughs> and I'm the canoe. I promised you I will smoke you out. Your madness never start to. This one will start now. Now market they go straight. Now from market square you go day. Because you have harmed Biaframs. You have traded with us so much. You have traded with us so much. You collect our money in the name of defense funds. And you cannot give account on how we will spend these defense funds. You are demanding that all Biafran should pay money to you on monthly basis. Or they will not be allowed to enter Biafra. Does this not make you a con man, an extortionist? Now you allege. The law says he who alleges must prove that he gave me 20 million. Hey, video not the lie. When I stated it last year leading to the election, you were so cowardly not to, 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 to respond to me. You sent your followers to respond and they said a lot of things. I demanded. Provide the evidence. I demanded 200 million from you. I've never been a member of IPOB. You gave me 20 million. I have produced it. Tell us now. Is it my bank transfer? Is it my cash? Who brought the cash to me? So please, I'm waiting. Produce the evidence. If you cannot produce the evidence, I'm not in doubt. I'm not surprised that you had always been a liar and you continue to be a liar. So there is no, no nothing about it. I'm not surprised at all. But I want to state that you have been a con man has been established. What job do you do? What work do you do? You call me a pipeline protector. A eh, pipeline protector are paid now. They are paid big, big, big money. You, where are you working? Who is paying you? Where do you get the money to galavant? Everywhere. Does money, do you pick money? Or you print money? Or does money fall from heaven? You call me a pipeline contractor. Yes, pipeline contractor. We make billions. So, you, which one are you doing? Because you must have a job to earn an income. You said, I am a pipeline contractor, so I am earning legitimate income. So where do you get your money from? Oh, oh, Kony Mantivu, Boggy Boggy, Furuba. You are a thief. You steal Biafran money, innocent Biafrans. You prey on the gullibility of innocent Biafrans. And you have the temerity to talk. One day for the thief. Plenty days for the thief and one day for the owner of the house. Very soon, you will be caught. A lot of people have given courage to a lot of people to come out to talk about you. You are nobody. What did your family contribute for Biafra? That's your father. That's your cold man father that died that you did not come. That's your warranty father that died that you did not come. And he, your mother, what did they contribute? What did your family lose? You are from, you are narrow. What did your family lose? They lost nothing. Nothing. My family lost so much. My grandmother was, was to be executed. He's known all over Calabar. She was one of the most outstanding and courageous Calabar princess. Not Waranchi princess. King Frederick, Prince Will, Tom Prince Will and Macri VIII abdicated these two, first time in 300 years, and left because of Biafra. He was among the five first class rulers in the eastern region. My auntie was killed, her body dumped into the river for the fishes to eat. A prominent woman in Calabar, a noble woman. 
my uncle was killed after they pointed him to the Nigerian soldiers. We have been making sacrifices. I have been to detention 76 times for the sake of fighting for the separation of our people from Nigeria. My case is a legal classical. It's there in the Supreme Court. You can go and look at it. I will not run. Because if I run, they will overrun my land. I can't stay in London and rat. My families are in Hero. They are in Kotonou. Everybody knows. My wives are in Hero. Some of my kids are in Hero. Some of my, my senior kids are here with me in my village. If anything happens, Kree come, they will also carry arms to fight. My kids. Anything as I'm going forward, they're at my back. Ah, daddy, let's go. And they're university students. Not that they're somewhere. Which work do you do? We make sacrifices for Biafra. We have gone to prison. I know the prison of Azuruke had gone. You want to be the only person in Biafra. I told you, you can't. Biafra does not belong to you. You know nothing about Biafra. You know, it's so sad that people can believe in you. I have never denied that I have Igbo blood, but Ijo is not Igbo. Ijo is far older than Igbo. I am not a Bendel man. I am an Abam. I am from a bomb in Abam. My great ancestor, Ediabal, is from a bomb in Abam. He was a fighter. King Amakri acquired him from the arrows and the Abam. Go and tell his father that the king wants his service. And that's how my father came into Jolan, became an Ejol man. That is the time, that is the name of Bia, Ediabal. He who kills at night. He wants to die. You want to die. So I've never denied my Igbo-ness. But when cold men like you spoil the name of Igbos, I should come out. My father Diabal became the richest man in the whole of this part of the world. He became an Arusa. So, I have never denied that I am an Igbo man. I have Igbo blood flowing in my vein. I have, will never deny it. But Ijo is not Igbo. Ijo is far older than Igbo in this part of the world. And Professor Dike, an Igbo man, was one of the first person to make research and stated this fact very clearly. If you are fighting for Biafra, which you are not, you are dividing Biafra, is to call, is to respect all Biafrans on equal basis. It just every Kibibi on equal basis. You cannot come and say, uh, Ibibi, is Ibo. Uh, is Ibo. That means you are fighting for an Ibo Biafra. You want to subject all Biafrans to become Ibos, which you will fail. It's your people will not become Ibo. I am a Biafran. I am an Igbo. I have Igbo blood flowing in me. In me. My other ancestors come from Ozoa calling. On, on, on my father's mother's uh, branch of my family. They come from Ozoa calling. We are proud of it. We are in contact with our relations. So we are not denying that we are Igbos. So don't preach this one. I am not any other person. I am, yes, my name is Uzo Demma. My great-grandmother gave my father the name Uzo Demma. Her name is Oiridea. So my name is Uzo Demma. My father gave it to me as his first son. Uzo Demma. Justice Melford Gooden gave it to me as his first son, as Uzo Demma. And I gave it to my fifth son, Mujahid, I gave him Uzo Demma. So, and I gave my little niece Oiridea. So I am not. If my children come up, I will continue to give them 
my Igbo name. I am proud of my Igbo ancestry. It is you, code men like you, that are destroying the Igbo nation. Those who life is money in our hand, the back in our ground, that are destroying the Igbo nation. Those of you that are Ben Johnson, that will run when they see battle. That is not what Abam stands for. I am a proud Abam. I am a proud John man. He just a crow you put to crow you put So you on both Igbo side, I am I descended from warriors. On the just side, I descended from warriors. Who are you, cone man? 